Does anybody understand what Hikaru is doing? Benjamin Block definitely does. For sure, Benjamin understands. <laughs> Without a doubt, Benjamin totally understands what's going on. Let's go here. Okay, let's see who's online. Let's play David Howell if he wants to play some Blitz. Oh, Fabiano's online too. Wow. Okay, let's play David Howell. My rating is really juice at the moment, so I'm probably going to be unhappy, and I'm probably going to lose points regardless of if I win the match. Let's do A6. I know this is not a good move, but we're going to do it. Oh, right. Thank you to NDMs for the Prime, Vinyl Corn for the Prime, Tech America with the Prime, Alep as well. Thank you so much. Let's go C5 here. Thank you to X-Man, Doba Q. Thank you to Fairy for the Prime. Thank you to Solar Eclipse for the Prime. I, I think I had this in a, in a blindfold game against... Um, who was it against? I think it was against... I think it was against Vasily Ivanchuk. I think I had this, or maybe I played the wrong order, but I had something very similar to this. Uh, let's go here. I don't want to blunder a knight c4. I'm just going to castle and go f6. Thank you, John Mack, for the two. Djibouti for the seven. Watchful Prism as well. Thank you so much. It's just castle. Thank you, T Gains, for the six months. I think I have f6. Maybe not, but I'm going to try it anyway. I don't see a capture because so I can just go knight c6. I mean, I'll pre move it because it's a safe pre move. Bishop e6 was also an idea, but I don't think this works. Okay, it goes there. Knight g4 is a good move, actually. A very good move that I missed. Let's go here. Go c3. Interesting. Oh, yeah. Actually, that makes sense. Okay, let's go here. Hit the rook. Thank you, Time Knights, for the prime. Thank you so much. Appreciate it. Thank you to Firmhead. Thank you to uh, Mr. Chestad. Thank you to Ye for Sunny on RGBD2. Thank you so much. Thank you to TV Nice for the prime. I know I missed some subs there in the middle. Sorry, you guys, if I, if I missed all your subs there. But, um, okay, let's go. It's Queen e5 and move. It looks good because I hit c3. He's got knight e3, but I think I can go bishop d3 maybe to hold everything. I'm very close to being better here, but I'm not better yet. And he also sacks, so I need to be very, very careful. Djokovic tried to bring this problem to tennis, but Nindal and Federer didn't care. <laughs> Okay, let's go here. I don't even know if this is right, but it looks right to hold everything, kind of. I think it's Zandora with the prime. Yes, yeah, so Arena Kings is later today. Arena Kings is in about three hours. What's the idea? Knight b3 might be a good move. I can also go queen b5. Queen c3, bishop d2, queen b2 is very... Oh, and then he's bishop c1 to make a draw? Okay, let's go here. I mean, this is a very wild position. Everything's kind of under attack here. Yeah, but we're, we keep we're keep rolling. Okay, I take the juicer. It's going to go a4, and I probably go queen a5. Knight d5, I just take. Yeah, arena kings on Mondays are always so late. It's kind of annoying, not going to lie. It was knight c2. Weird. Oh, he wants what? Bishop e3? Okay, I'm not going to take. I can go queen a5. Let's just go here and hit the pawn, maybe. One, two, three. I can play rook b7 or rook d7. I'm going to go here and just takes. Oh, that was bad by me, maybe. Actually, no, maybe I just take and go knight, knight f5 or knight c6. I mean, he has bishop h3, but I always have f5. I should be better here. Okay, first of all, there's f5. Let's go f5. Maybe bishop e4 here to close the door. Makes sense, because I, I can close the door and then take the bishop. Looks good. Thank you to, thank you to Small and Lee for the two months. I whore Pechati for the prime. Filatero for the five bucks. DJ for the five as well. Thank you so much. Sorry if I'm running extra ads, you guys, but I forgot to run some ads. And I think I mentioned this before, but I'm, I'm behind on my ads for the uh, for, for this month. So I kind of need to run more ads than usual at the moment. So apologies for that. Okay, rookie six is a move. Actually, why did I allow this? Should I go here and rook f7, maybe? Yeah, I've kind of misplayed this a little bit. Don't really want to trade. Don't really want to go... Ah, he's got bishop c5, which is a problem. Maybe I just take and go, like, here... He, oh, he's also got no time. I just realized he's got 26 seconds. So I just need to cheese him on the clock here, basically. Okay, 
Okay, there we go. Play E4. Thank you so much for the uh, for the eight months. I need a Musa for the two as well. Thank you so much. Let's go here. Okay, it goes e6, so I go d4, probably knight e3. Maybe I play a... F Actually, I think I play a4 and c3. I've got to chip away to structure a little bit here. It goes b4, very interesting choice. Just castle, probably knight c4. C5, to be expected. I have knight e5 and bishop f3. I also have knight g5, maybe just bishop e3. Don't really want to trade. Hmm. Let's go rookie one. I'm gonna actually go bishop f1 and try to just grab this pawn on h3 if I can. Actually, I blunder d4, kind of, maybe not. Have to be a little bit careful. Okay, I go b3, of course. Goes knight b6. I can play knight a5 here if I want. Doesn't look right. Knight e3 doesn't look right either. Knight b6 doesn't look right either. I'll just go here. I have to be very careful not to get mated. But if I can take the pawn, I'm probably winning. Maybe winning's too strong, but I should be much better. Okay, does that. I mean, I think I can take. If it's no good, it's no good, but I want to see it. Whoa, he just takes? What? Wait a second. First of all, I can take with the bishop. He's got bishop f6 or something? Wait, so do I take with the rook, maybe? Or do I take with the pawn? Pawn takes is definitely a move here. Maybe not a great move. I'll take with the pawn so I can go e4. Okay, but that doesn't look right somehow. Oh, he's got uh he's got e5. Let's go here. Threatening 96, maybe. I also have a5. Maybe. Hey Ryan Gator. For the online Olympiad, I don't know what the prize would be. Can go a5. I might have to sack. Wait, do I have some bizarre sack? go here and here I have knight of five or something I'm trying to go for an Anastasia checkmate something really weird I don't know if it works but it looks exciting so if he takes the bishop I have check and I have an Anastasia on the side of the board and if he goes here I just block with him this is actually very interesting this might be just working for me This is very interesting. Because if he, if he, he takes, he just, if there's just, wait, can't I? Oh, wait, no, this, oh, wait a second, knight h6? Wait a second. I also have queen d4, wait a second, this must be winning somehow. Wait, wait, wait a second, queen d4, knight h6, king h7, doesn't work. Let's go, oh, he's got queen c5 or something? How is there not a win here? Knight g7, rook d8. Ugh. Ugh, there's no win? Do I, wait, queen g4 maybe? Let's go here. Let's go here. e5, knight e6. Queen c5, I just take. Play a5, I can also take. Do I throw an a5 as a question? Probably I just. Oh, wait, he's got queen c5. I gotta be careful. Let's go here. Oh, maybe I go queen g6. Hmm. 
Wait a second. I gotta be careful here. Two takes. I should put the queen on h5. It was a mistake. It's got no checks. I'm threatening mate or not? No mate here? Wait. Yeah, it's just mate. He just got boxed. Check. Check and mate. Let's go g6. Maybe bishop g7 next move. Let's go a6. I think he had some way to survive that, but he didn't see it. Let's go here in 97 maybe. I think Tianduri, Fox for tier one and Pyrite Hippo for the tier one. Go here and Bishop B7 and just castles. I think Allison UK for the 10 months. Thank you so much, Allison UK. Just take and go Queen E7. I'm going to play A5 and Queen E7 here. Maybe Knight C5 at some point. Yeah, Rook G2 was winning. That's why I should have played Queen H5 instead of Queen G6, I think. I think Queen H5 instead of Queen G6 was the right move, but maybe not. I mean, it probably, maybe it's all just losing. I, I I don't know. I think Cortez the killer for the prime. Thank you so much, Cortez. Appreciate it. Thank you. Let's go H6. I mean, I always have G5 or Knight C5 here. Actually, why did I do this? Kind of dubious. Let's go here. Okay, I can play queen c5 here. I also knight c5 maybe. Yeah, let's go here. And a bishop b5. Whoa, I was not expecting that. Well, that's a weird move. Let's go here. Hit the queen. Let's go here. go here I think I'm gonna go here and bishop h6 maybe be a little bit careful how I play this though it's a little bit dubious oh I gave him 95 he doesn't take advantage I have to be very very careful I go here it's got 95 I have to be very very careful here maybe rook c8 Still, he doesn't take advantage. Okay, I guess I go back. It's a4. I can play bishop c5 if I want. Knight d5, knight d5, takes, takes, takes. Not ideal. Okay, let's go here. I thought I had bishop c5 here because now I can just take everything because the rook guards against this threat. That looks wrong. Okay, let's go h4. See four. Oh, that's maybe a good move. Can I go b5? I'm gonna try c6 and b5 here. Try to hit the knights because his knights are kind of clumsy. I'll pre move this. Oh, he's got knight g4. Oh no. Oh well, I have to do this then. He's got no time though. Let's go here. Can I get away with something? I've got to do something. Not f5. Let's just go. Hmm. How do I do this? Not f6. He takes with a pawn. Kind of weird. But I'm probably just lost here somehow. Uh. Shoot. I'm just lost. I just blundered. Or am I? Wait, he just played a wrong move. Actually, he played the wrong move. He's supposed to go rook d6 first. Wait, there's got to be something here. Wait a second. Takes knight. 
I can make a draw with Queen G3, but I don't really want to make a draw. Wait, let's let's try to get tricky. Because I have this and this. Uh-huh, Bishop F3 is a really tricky move by me. I think I'm going to win the game now. Maybe, maybe not. Wait, takes and Queen G3? Takes. Okay, let's just. I can just flag him here. He's got no chance. Yeah, I just flag him. No draws. There we go, get another win. Let's play E4. I'm gonna play A4, I don't know if it's necessary. Let's go here and rook, maybe Rook D1. So let's go A5 and A6. Oh, I just blundered. Or did I? Wait, no, I have queen e3. Takes on a5, kind of weird. I'm taking go knight e5 here. I think I'm just going to play c3, consolidate my structure. So queen c7, I can actually take, but I think knight g5 looks reasonable. Knight e5 also looks good. Um, I think I'm just going to drop back. Probably not even best, but I don't want to do anything stupid. I'm, I want to go knight g5 here. I don't know if it works, but I really want to play it. I want to play it, so I'm going to go for it with like some weird knight e6 trick or knight f5 tricks. Great gift. No, the great gift doesn't apply there. Um, let's go here. This game I'm playing poorly. I'm playing pretty poorly this game. Hmm. Let's go here. I know this is right. Can obviously trade. I mean, I don't really want to. I can also trade this one. I put my knights on terrible squares for no real good reason. He's got queen c6, I just realized also. So I have this. I go here. I mean, a5 is hanging. I also have c4. I have to go, like, here and take. Playing this game awfully. I mean, I feel like I'm about to blunder something here. I really do feel like it. Let's go here, maybe, to hold? Because I can hit this. My knights are so awful here on the edge. This knight is just so bad on h3. I can take the pawn. I'm going to grab it. I don't know if it's right, but I'm going to grab it. Just go here. Go here, maybe a five, a four, fifty-seven. Don't really want to play rookie one. I also don't want to trade. This is bad, really bad. Um, I'm gonna try to keep pieces on the board. Let's go here. Let's go here and here. I'm gonna trust that he is nothing, basically that four. I 
guess I take with the bishop or the knight. I think I take with the knight. I guess I'll go here and queen up two. Yeah, that's just awful. I just blundered. Ah, <sighs> so bad. Unless there's some trick. Let's try this. It's got that. I go here to hit the knight, hit the bishop. I mean, I can just take... Oh wait, I can't go there, I have to go here. Just go here and C4 maybe. Wait, does that actually work? I have no good moves. Yeah, that's a good move. Oh, it's just this. Yeah, this is just bad game. Garbage game by me. Really, really poor game. Really, really poor game. So what, minus 13 for that? Go here. Terrible game. Last two, last two. I just shouldn't be playing him at this rating. I also played this terribly too. Whoa, thank you to Accent Tentacium for the raid with 5151. Thank you so much for the raid, man. I appreciate it. Hope all is well in Poland, or as they say, Polska Guram, right? I think that's the saying. Could have gone here. I mean, the problem is my knight is so bad on H8. I also don't really like his style. He plays this very, I don't know, he feels like he's playing this very... Okay, but now my knight gets out at least. If my knight gets out, I have some hope at least. I'm going to have to go for broke though right away, like C5. I have to go for this immediately. Let's go here. Right, but this can't be right. This feels wrong somehow. Wait, let's go check. This feels very wrong with bishop b4. Wait, or rook c8? I probably have something here where I'm fine. I'm gonna go rook c8 first though. Because if g4 I trade, I take, take, and then I take, and then I get him on this diagonal. I think I'm gonna survive this. I got lucky here. He played this really badly. Thank you to Cliff Dogsome. Thank you to Encoses for the Prime Chess Master MD. Gautier Blowbacks. We're playing Blitz here, you guys. Those of you who are from, from uh, Polska, or um, la 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 from XX Tentessian stream. Sorry about that. Uh, I misplayed this. Wait, but I can take and take and go D4 or something? No, I can't. That's no good either. Bishop B4 is a ridiculous move by me. Why did I do that? I guess I'll take and I'm gonna play this in knight g3 and hope. Maybe I could have moved my knight first. That was probably better. Because Givor wasn't actually a threat in one. And I have this and this. If I get knight b6, maybe it's okay. Plays rook g1. I think I should definitely go g5 to, to glue this. I gave him a4, but I have a8-6 maybe, or king d7. I probably can draw this now, but I feel like I missed something. Good thing is he can't really attack. That's a, the big plus here. You can go bishop c4 at some moment. How do I route my knight? I'm just going to go here. If a4, I guess I'll go a5. Everything's on dark squares here, so I think it's okay. I mean, unless he's... Hmm. Okay, I'm gonna go for something with rook d8 and then back. Wait, 
Wow, really? Really? He was happy with a draw there? Wow. It's pretty surprising. I thought he would want more out of that. Let's go here in 92. I mean, I guess he gains rating points, so probably he doesn't mind that much. This is a very old line. I haven't played this in many, many years. I think knight g3 and like bishop d2. I forget how this line goes. This is a very, very old line. I haven't looked at this in a very long time. Right, knight c6. I, I know that's a move. I think I go here and bishop b5. Or no, queen a4 is the move. Queen a4 was 100% the move there. 150% the move there. Ugh. Guess I'll go here and try to do something with bishop c3, maybe? Doesn't feel right at all, but maybe I can somehow survive this. So maybe I can take with a knight. I think I should just take and take and hope. Yeah, when you remember the right move after the last one, it's really unpleasant. Thank you to Doric, thank you to Shady, thank you to Doric Kachinchi for the 10, thank you so much. Yeah, when you forget the move right afterwards, it's a very awful feeling. Make no mistake. Okay, it goes there. I mean, this is not what I wanted, but it shouldn't be that bad, I don't think. Let's go. I'll go here, maybe bishop e2. It's not as bad as I think it should be. It should be really bad, but if he doesn't prove it in the next move or two and I get development, I'm probably completely fine. Goes h5. Strange move. Maybe strange. Maybe a good move. h3, g3. I don't really know if I like that move from him. H4, knight 2, H3, G3, bishop G4, castles, and knight of 4. Probably not so bad, actually. I don't, I don't, H5 doesn't seem like the right move at all. What's his idea? His idea of bishop F5. Well, first of all, I have this, which I'm almost certainly going to play here because now I, now I can just castle. And now if I get H4, I'm just better. He has no bishop F5. I think he made a mistake here. Unless he can prove something in the next two moves, he's just going to be worse after h4, f3. Thank you to Greg Rosen and Blotty for the three. Thank you so much. Appreciate it. Because he's also got to worry about this pawn, too. Does anybody understand what Hikaru is doing? Benjamin Bach definitely does. For sure, Benjamin understands. <laughs> Without a doubt, Benjamin totally understands what's going on. Let's go here. It goes there, so I take. I mean, I don't want to go c6. I don't really want to play h4 either. I think I will just play h4. I'm going to go like rook b1. Try to attack this way. So knight f8, the knight h5, right? Yeah, okay, let's go here. Rook b8 is a big threat now. I feel like I should be better here somehow. This feels better. My knight's not good. He wants queen g7. I should be better here. Let's go here. No rookie one because I just take no rook moves, no knight moves. I think he's in really bad shape. He's maybe king g no king g seven rook b seven. I also have rook b eight. I thought somehow he's hanging on by a thread when he shouldn't be. Why take this pawn off the board? Hmm. B eight rook e eight rook b seven maybe that looks. I actually don't see a win, so I'm just going to drop back. Maybe rook b8 next move. I should not have gone queen e6. That was just a bad move. I thought I had rook b8 here. b1, king h2. I feel like there's something. This must takes. Oh, he's got bishop g4 at the end. Shoot. Okay. I'm just going to go f3 then. Oh, did I just give him bishop g4 anyway? Oh my god. He misses it, thankfully. I think I think Bishop G4 is just winning for him, maybe. Okay, I'm up time. So I, I should win this game if I'm smart about how I use my time. Let's go here. Let's go here. Let's 
He's got no time, so I'm gonna have to flag him, but it's a flag is good enough here, I think. Actually, wait, no, that's even. That's six. That's a good score. It's an even number. Yeah, it's, he's he's too good. I can. Be, I mean, I win the match, but he's 200, 230 points. I'm just. I'm gonna lose. I'm gonna bleed rating points nonstop against him. I can probably beat him like three to one, but I beat him three to one at those points. This doesn't look like pinball. <laughs>